Home form is vital to survival, and in that case, it's been a good start to life back in Ligue 1 for Metz. Four points from six garnered at the Stade saint saint forain So far, the debut for Florent Malouda, hoping to aspire another three. Malouda's former Les Bleus and Chelsea teammate Claude Makaleli on the Bastia bench. As we've seen his side struggle so far, with only one win in their last eight away trips. And without striker Brandao after he was suspended for six months for an attack on Thiago Mota. But Bastia had the first meaningful sight of goal. Floyd Ayete released. The initial shot was blocked, but it came back to Gaji Talo. His effort clipping off the top of the crossbar. Well, Metz came from behind to defeat Lyon here in week four, but this time they took the lead. Bastia making their own troubles. But Sergei Krevets, terrific finish. His first goal since his summer arrival from Bate. Certainly the Belarusian onside before finding the top corner. But Mess couldn't hold out until the halftime interval. Three minutes before the break, an even better effort. Ayiti with a fantastic volley on the run. Summer signing from Rance with his first goal. The Bastia Blue. A delight for Makaleli to see his side level. Maluda hoping to inspire a second half revival. Well, Metz lost out to a last-minute goal last time out. We're certainly hoping to show more steel. And when great improvisation, this wonderful overhead kick. Saw Kravets run through. The ball broke, though. Guedo Milan with his first Metz goal since arriving in 2012. Just after the hour mark in the end. It was the pressure of Krivets. It was Guillaume Gile signing from Anderlecht, whose slice clearance allowed Milan to score. And Mess weren't finished there. So they went on to make the point safe. Krivets, the provider this time. And Falcon, who scored the late winner against Lyon, profiting from the Belarusians' cutback. And his second league on goal. Mess could have made it even more emphatic. Falcon looking to lay it back. Krivets with a 1 2 off the Bastia defender. But this time couldn't find the back of the net. Metz climb into the top half while Bastia leave with nothing.